of all the new stuff that showed up in Chrome OS 125 to kind of go along with Google's new announcement of all the new Chromebook Plus models and all the new Chromebook Plus features, probably the most talked about one and maybe the most uh, anticipated of these new features is Help Me Write. It's something we've been talking about since October of last year when they first announced Chromebook Plus to begin with. And it's finally here. And we've had a few questions about how it works, like when you should use it and when you should use a different tool. So we just kind of wanted to go a little bit deeper into this particular part of Chrome OS 125 for Chromebook Plus in this version of Chrome OS and beyond. But before we get into that, I wanted to talk to you really quickly about our uh, enhanced Chrome Unboxed Plus community. And so we've had this type of community off and on for the last few years, but we've really kind of changed things up now and we're super excited about it. We're seeing all kinds of growth and lots of new people in there great discussion, all sorts of benefits from being a part of Chrome Unbox Plus. You can find out more about it at chromeunbox.com forward slash join, but we're doing stuff like exclusive giveaways, AMAs with the Chrome OS team. You get an ad-free experience uh, on the website. You're also getting an ad-free podcast. It's two bucks a month. And I'm telling you, the community is vibrant and awesome. So. Uh, if you haven't yet, go check it out. I think it's uh, something a lot of you would be very interested in. And then again, it's just a community that's growing and is just a fun thing to be a part of. So real quick, before we get in on the Chromebook, like what is Help Me Write? If you haven't seen this before, or if you've maybe just kind of heard about it, uh, the idea is pretty simple and we've seen it a little bit in like in Chrome on other platforms and you've probably heard this term used in some of Google's other services. We're gonna get to that in a second, but the idea is where you are right in flow, um, regardless of what uh, website you're on or what you're doing at the time, Chromebooks now, if Chromebook Plus, has this feature called Help Me Write. You right click into a text field and immediately you have the option to help you create small snippets of text to uh, rephrase things. I'm going to show you all those all those features that, that go along with this. but. The, the simple idea, the simple way to say it is this is a way for you when you need to write shorter text snippets, whether it's uh, in X or Facebook or you're writing a review on Amazon or something, and you can't quite get the words right or you just don't like the way it sounds, this is a tool to help you do that without having to go open Gemini or go open chat GPT or something like that. It's right in line. It works. I want to show it to you and then show you Google's other versions of the same tool that work in some of their other services and some of the confusion that's come up because of that. So let's let's just hop in here. So first up, we have uh, X pulled up here. And so uh, if anything weird pops up in my feed, apologies ahead of time. You never know. It looks like apparently biggest burn in television history with Alex Trebek is playing right there. Um, so say I want to go in here. Let's just use that. Um, yeah, that's a good thing to do. I want to write, um, I don't know, a, a, a tweet about uh, Jeopardy and how much I like Jeopardy. I'm not quite sure what to say, so I'm gonna right click in here and boom, help me write pops up immediately. And so I'm gonna, I'm gonna click in here and say, um, let's see, write a tweet. We still call them tweets even though it's X. That makes sense, right? Uh, write a tweet about uh, Alex Trebek and, ooh, we'll do the SNL parody. Uh, SNL parody with Will Ferrell. Just see what it comes up with. That was right off the cuff. Here we go. SNL, so funny. Love Alex Trebek parody. I spelled his name wrong. Um, yeah, NBC, not sure if I ever laughed as hard. Will Ferrell, okay. You get the gist. Uh, a handful of options here. But now I can click into refine. I can have it rephrase. Uh, I can emojify it. Let me just do that real quick so you can see. It just adds a bunch of emojis where, um, you know, this isn't a great tweet, I guess, for emojis. But, you know, if that was something about, I don't know, a phone or uh, writing something, you know, we'd use pencils and all that kind of stuff. Um, let's go, I'm gonna formalize, let's formalize this. Let's be real formal about this. The current episode of SNL is absolutely hilarious. The Alex Trebek parody with Will Ferrell was particularly enjoyable, very formal. Uh, anyway, you get the idea. So there's uh, multiple ways we can change. Uh, we can shorten this, that was already pretty short. Uh, and then now you got it down to just one sentence. Um, so there's a handful of ways you can do stuff. Um, it's say though, I'm gonna go to my profile here and I'm actually gonna grab, um, trying to find a longer tweet here. So I'm gonna grab this tweet here and then go into the post, 
I'm gonna put that there and then just hit rephrase. And so it can, oh, I gotta select my stuff here, sorry. There we go. Now I'll go rephrase. And, oh, it's because I have a link in there. Sorry about that. So rephrase. And so you see my original tweet there and then you got some other options. Um, you can thumbs up, thumbs down the stuff that you like and help the, uh, the model learn uh, a little bit better about what you do and don't like. But you get the gist here. This is gonna give you a way to quickly write a short snippet of text. And what that does is that leads directly into someone thinking, well, this would be great for email, right? I, this would be an awesome tool for me to use uh, to send to send just a quick email reply. So now I'm in my email, I'm in Gmail here, and I'm like, oh, okay, I need to write, um, uh, let's see, I need to write an email about, um, I need a new coffee mug for my desk. Well, I go in here and I go, cool, I'm gonna do that. Oh, where is it? Where's the help me write thing? Well, of course it's not there because Gmail already has help me write uh, built in. So if we go down here to the bottom, you can see right there, help me write. Click into it, same exact thing pops up here. Uh, help me write uh, an email asking for a new mug for my desk. Let's see what it comes up with. That's an absurd thing to ask it. But hi there, I'm writing to request a new mug for my desk. My current mug is chipped and cracked, and I'd appreciate a replacement. Thanks. Just don't click send with your name and and and. Uh, uh, brackets there that would look kind of dumb, but you get you get the idea here. And so now I'm going to go over to uh, Google Docs. Help me write is right there at the top. Again, you gotta you gotta have Gemini and you know be paying for this kind of stuff. Uh, and that, what's really cool with Chromebook Plus right now um, at ChromeUnbox.com, we'll put a link in the description. Remind me, put a link in the description. Um, we'll put a link in the description to the article that helps you. Even if you've got a device prior to the, all these new announcements. Uh, you can still snag one year of Gemini Advanced. It comes with Gemini in like Docs and Gmail and all that stuff. But I'm gonna hit Help Me Write. Um, let's see. Um, le oop. Click in there first. A letter to my mom for Mother's Day. Don't do this. Make sure and write your letters, please. Um, I don't know why that popped into my head, but that's what popped into my head. There you go. You're going to get a Hallmark card here is what's going to happen. Um, yeah, and so obviously, you know, we can refine this. Uh, this is AI after all. So we can click in here and make some custom things. Uh, can you make it more poetic? And again, it's Gemini. It's the Gemini model that's kind of being infused into these spaces. But the main point I wanted to get to here, look, it wrote a poem. Um, it could be good. I'm not going to spend the time to read it. But um, the point is here is this is in flow. It's right in line. But if you don't know what you're doing with it, some people's first instinct would have been to go to Gmail, to go to Docs, a place where they can write and try to uh, pull up Help Me Write and to, to help them write something. And it wouldn't work. And then you're like, oh, crap, why, don't, why am I not getting this? I don't understand why this isn't working. This is why. Uh, it is meant for places where Google hasn't already put Gemini and, and AI models into their stuff. Uh, so, I mean, WhatsApp, Google Messages, actually I think Messages might have uh, some AI stuff built in. So it's either gonna be, you know, the Chromebook, letting the Chromebook do this stuff, which is Help Me Write is built onto Chrome OS. So uh, it's anywhere you have a text field that already isn't taken up by uh, Google's own AI stuff in their in their products. But, um, you know, it's it, you can use it wherever you want to, anywhere you need it. You need to write an Amazon review, you need to write whatever. You can use Help Me Write anywhere that, you know, AI isn't already there. And so so it's wildly helpful. And again, once you kind of understand how to use it and what you can do with it, uh, it's becoming more and more a thing that I'm, I'm starting to rely on. And not so much to create content as to maybe just spice it up a little bit, to rephrase something, to maybe like, eh, I got too off the cuff. Let's formalize that a little better. Let's let's change the tone of that particular tweet or that particular message I was getting ready to send. Uh, and I think those types of AI are wildly helpful and they're things that Chrome OS is getting right, that Google's getting right with Chromebooks right now in AI. It's something that can be delivered very easily, very quickly, right where you are, right in flow of what you're doing. I love it. I'm hoping this video helps you make the most of this new feature. I think it's something a lot of us uh, that use Chromebooks are gonna find a lot of worth and value in. But guys, that's it for this one. If you like this video, give us a thumbs up, head down there, hit subscribe, and be sure to ring the notification icon as well if you'd like to be alerted when we make future videos just like this one. Till next time, we'll see you.